Hey guys, Cameron here, Smart Adult Music. A couple weeks ago, um, I was working with a young man who has uh, been kind of a special project of mine. Very talented young man, and we were starting to work on learning how to play by ear. And this can be a tricky subject for uh, people who haven't done it before, and a lot of people think that they can't, um, and that's not true. I think it, anybody can. Um, so, but you do, one of the things you need to do to play by ear is connect it to your voice. And I think connecting your playing to your voice uh, is always important uh, because otherwise you're just pressing keys and typing if you don't have that connection. Um, and not all of us are great singers, certainly I'm not, but I can hit pitches with my voice. So let's just do something really super simple. Just a little kid's song at first that I think everybody knows. Um, let's start with Twinkle Twinkle Little Star. And that's a good one too because that one starts on the keynote or, or the tonic note as we say. And um, so let's start on C and uh, <clears throat> then we'll uh, use our voice. Twinkle, 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 da da. So where is that note? Da da, da da. Uh, there it is. Da da. Okay, we have our first two notes. Da da, twinkle, twinkle, little. Oh, that's not it. Don't be afraid to make mistakes. If you have to hunt and peck around, it's okay. Twinkle, twink, twinkle, twinkle, little. There it is, little star. Twinkle, twinkle, little star. How I wonder where you are. Yay, we got it. Okay. Twinkle, twinkle, little star. How I wonder where you are. Okay, so now we need the next part. Up, up, up. Uh, 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 uh. There it is. Uh, up, uh. Now it probably is just gonna walk down like it did before. Up, up, up. The world's so high. Like a diamond in the sky. The next part repeats, right? Twinkle, twinkle, little star, how I wonder where you are. Okay, now let's put some chords to that. So usually songs like this will use the primary chords in a key. Uh, if you don't know what that means, you can go check out my video on that subject. Um, and we're just going to use our triads, and again, if you're not comfortable with what triads are, um, you can also check out what I have on that. But let's uh, just assume, since this uh, song starts on the tonic or the keynote, um, that the first chord is going to be the one chord. So we will start with, we're going to move our melody up here. Same note, starting on C, we're just going to move it up an octave. And then we'll start with our <clears throat> key note chord, C. Okay. Twinkle, twinkle, and we're gonna keep playing this chord until it doesn't sound right. Twinkle, twinkle, lid. Does that sound right to you? Lid. No. Okay, so we need to find another chord. So we know it's probably either gonna be the four chord, which is F, one, two, three, four, F chord, or the five chord, G. One, two, three, four, five, G. So let's try G. Twinkle, twinkle, little. Oh, that doesn't sound right, does it? Twinkle, twinkle, little. Mm -mm. Okay, so let's try the four chord, the F chord. Twinkle, twinkle, little. Oh, nice. Little star, oh, that doesn't work, so maybe we need to try the one chord star, oh lovely, 
So now we have this twinkle, twinkle, little star. Okay? Now, star, how are we? That doesn't work. How I? Let's try. Let's try the F chord. Uh, oh, nice. How I wonder where, where it doesn't work. So is the F chord gonna work? Where? Not really. So maybe we're gonna have to use the five chord, the G chord. Where you? Oh, lovely. Where you are. All right. So now we have our song. Twinkle, or the first part anyway. Twinkle, twinkle, little star, how I wonder where you are. Lovely, right? Okay. So, so now we remember. Up above the world so high. So, up above, does that work? Uh, up above the world. Nope. Gee, there we go. Like a diamond in the sky. Yay! Twinkle, twinkle, little star. Uh, nope. How uh, I wonder where you are. Okay. So, now we know how to play Twinkle Twinkle Little Star, and we figured it out by ear, okay? Okay, guys, so, now when we play the chords like this, that's really unwieldy, right? So we want to use inversions to do that. And if you don't know what inversions are, I'm going to do a video on that right away, so we can, you can play the chords more easily, okay? All right, guys, go have fun figuring out some songs.